What's going on boys and girls, it's Muntage Gaming here again and welcome back to the channel. Today we're back on Ark Survival Evolved, official PvP, and I think this is episode 5 of the Road to Tech series, and uh, we're going to be continuing off where we left off in the last episode where we're prefabbing the base, and uh, we're going to start laying out the foundations and actually start building it. So, we're going to get into that now, and without further ado, I hope you guys enjoy and let's get into it. All right, this is what we're working with so far. I think this is a four by five, if I'm not mistaken, yeah. So eventually we wanna make this into a six by six, but we don't have enough metal and we need to expand as soon as possible because we have too much shit. All right, gates going up here on the back side. Uh, at the front, eventually we're gonna have a Behe gate, but at the back gate, we're gonna have these Dino gates. And uh, yeah, it's looking pretty sexy, boys. And now we're just gonna go four high on the walls to uh, match up with the Dino Gate. All right, looking good boys. We've got a base inside a base right now. If someone hit us right now, it'd be pretty fucking easy to uh, wipe us. Actually, no, it wouldn't be. Everyone's just got Prim Flax, so yeah, we'd be fine. But anyway, we're just um, sussing out how we're gonna lay this out, like the crafting area and everything like that. But uh, I think it's gonna look pretty sexy, not gonna lie. All right, with the resources I'm getting from this base, I'm gonna start crafting up the second level of this one. Because uh, that's where we're going to place the generator, if anyone wants to know. <laughs> Alright, we've got a cable down, and I think we're just going to snap it like this. Yeah, fuck it, whatever. Alright, cool. Now let's start laying out these cables. Ceiling is done, but there's this fucking thing here that's triggering me. But we'll have to worry about that later. Better continue on doing all this shit. Um, and now I think we need to put up the turret, so... Alright, there you go, guys. We ended up running out of metal, but you kind of get the gist, and the hatch frames are pretty scuffed right now. Um, because it is a 5x6, we weren't really, we couldn't really decide on how to put the hatch frames, so what I'm going to be doing now is farming up a bunch of metal to get it to a 6x6, because it's still my OCD in right now. So we're going to get it to a 6x6, then the diner gate is going to be uh, centered, and then we can put the hatch frames down properly, and make it look nice. Uh, but yeah, it's looking pretty good now. We need to layer this whole side on the, uh, the left. We need to layer that with plant turrets because it's looking a bit undefended right now. But yeah, I'm really happy that we expanded. We can put all the kibble dinos inside now so no one can snipe them. And uh, yeah, we can we can actually move around in there all together. Because before with the 2x2, two two, pretty much you can only have one person in there at a time. I'm really happy with the progress so far. And um, I'm going to be farming pretty hard right now. The two main goals I want to get done is turn this into a 6x6, six six, uh, simultaneously farming pearls um, every time the pearls respawn for more turrets. We're going to plant turrets on the left side and then level 75 is the next priority for vaults because we really need vaults for storage. Alright, so the guys that we raided uh, in the past two videos I think, they've uh, actually built up in secret on a raft and now they just appeared out of nowhere and had six turrets on their fucking, on their base. So, we're gonna go over there and see if we can raid it. I can imagine that they're gonna have some juicy, juicy loot. So, anyway, I'm kitted up. We're gonna fly over there and I'll see you guys soon. Alright, here we are. And as you can see, they got six turrets up and their base is still part stone. So, I'm gonna just fucking YOLO it in there and see if I can get in and C4. If I can, this is gonna be great. If not, it's going to be not so great. <laughs> anyway, looks like they've made lots of progress. Like, they haven't been here at all. They've been on their boat the whole time. Oh my god, I can fit underneath there. I just saw one of them do it. If they have a turret under there, then I'm fucked. <laughs> Can I cave, cave you under? Oh my god, they got more ramps here that I can run under. Should I just try it? Can you come over here and whistle the bird? Alright, here goes nothing, I guess. Yeah, I'm in. Nice, Easy. nice. Easy. They're, they're still watching me. They're still watching me. Alright, I'm C4ing. Down. Turrets are down. Uh, turrets are up. No, turrets are up. Turrets are up. They're up? Alright. Yeah, I'm looking at them right now. Okay, okay. They're coming in for you. 
Oh yeah, he sees me. Ah, oh, C4 bugged. No, 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 no. Turret shooting you. Grapple one. Grapple. Th Fuck! Unfortunately, we ended up dying there. However, we took down the whole side wall because we dropped the uh, the ceiling or the pillar that was supporting it. So Xero was able to see spin in there and uh, kill them all with the Pteranodon. And he could also take out the generator as well. So we're just flying back with the RG now to start looting everything. And uh, yeah, let's see what we get. Okay, all well, this shit is pin coded. Ooh, fabric. Ooh, gunpowder for days, bro. Holy shit. Beautiful. Easy. Got an here. Is this my kit? Oh no, they have a fucking 3.6k right, um, not right shield, metal shield. Fuck yeah. Oh my god, that's so fucking juicy. Ooh, four Stego eggs. Hey, more fucking Stego kibble for the Argies. Narco berries for days. They must have another Bronto somewhere. Spark, we'll take that. These guys are farmers, bro. Holy shit. Got my armor back, got my C4 back. That's all I fucking care about. Don't need this shit. 22 ladders, Jesus. I don't want this shit. I can have that. Put that in there. Alright, on to the storage boxes now, I guess. Ooh, black pearls. Take them. Got tranks, arrows. We got charcoal for days. Ooh, an ascended fucking hatchet? I'll take it. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Where are these guys farming drops? Like? No idea. Ooh, oil for days. Yeah, they've been living the boat life, bro. Yeah, the RG is heavy as fuck right now. Ooh, 50 gas. Some more gunpowder. Narcs for days. Oh my god, the turrets aren't even pink coated, bro. Let me break this box. What's this one gonna have in it? Tech? Road to tech finished? Oh, more gunpowder. Oh, 189 sword BP. 120 damage prim crossbow B B B B BP. What the fuck? Hell yeah. Hey, we hit level 75, boys. Just killed an Alpha Kano. And uh, oh, we got a level on the RG as well. 2.4k weight. Beautiful. And here we are. Level 75. Oh my god, I'm so happy that's done. That was cancerous farming the Alpha Carnos and Raptors and stuff, especially the Alpha Raptors, because they just. The AI is so bad. Anyway, we can finally learn this bad boy. Oh my god. Alright, time to craft up a bunch of these, chuck them down so that we have actual storage. So, I'll get back to base and I'll uh, see you guys soon. Actually, before I forget, I don't know how, but I ended up losing footage of upgrading the base to a 6x6. So here we are now. As you can see, the dining gate is nice and centered. And uh, yeah, it's looking pretty nice. We finished up the inside. We got the four hatch frames up on the outside with the turrets. And uh, yeah, we got the second floor done, as I said. Got the storage boxes down and yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, there's a few upgrades we need to do, but we'll get those done once we place down the vaults. And yeah, anyway, I'm going to go out, farm up some polymer, and uh, we'll come back to craft up the vaults. See you guys then. Alright, so we cleared all the icebergs with the penguins on them, and uh, how much poly do we end up with? So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 320 poly around there. Um, so yeah, we're going to fly back. How many vaults can we make with that? I'm not even sure. But I think we're aiming for like four. Can we make four? Oh no, we can't. We need 360 for... F Do we need 360? Yeah, we need 360. Hmm. All right, let's, uh, let's fly around a bit more and try and get 360. And then uh, I'll see you guys back at base. And we're back at base. Gonna load the poly in now and I'll see how many... I'm gonna make some turrets as well because I... I got a bunch of electronics, well not electronics, I got a bunch of pearls on the way back. So, let's see what we can make. Well, three turrets. Two volts so far, I think I need more, uh, more poly in there. There we go boys, four volts. Oof! I'm so happy, holy shit. How many vo how many turrets can we make? Three. Can we make more? Or do we need more metal? Nah, no, nah, we can't make more, we need more electronics. 
Easy boys. Four volts, three more turrets. Fuck yeah, I'm so happy with that. Alright, time to place them. Alright, there we go. Four volts down. Looking pretty nice, I must admit. Awesome, I'm really happy with that. Now, even if we do get raided, they're going to have to invest a lot of C4 into blowing into those for loot. So yeah, really happy about that. Anyway, we're going to end the episode there, guys. I hope you did enjoy. I apologize for the short episode. Uh, as I said earlier, I lost a bunch of footage, which would have buffered this video up a couple more minutes. Um, so yeah, I apologize for that, but it was out of my hands. I don't know how I lost it. Uh, so in the next episode, we're probably going to be, I think we have a Quetz team coming in, uh, some more leveling and looking for other teams as well, like uh, Mega Theoriums and stuff like that. So anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, comment in the comment section below, subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, stay fucking awesome and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.